everybody, it's your old pal Adrian, also known as the Wandering Art Historian. It's been a hot minute since we've all been able to get together and talk about art, so I thought I'd whip up this little video here to say hey, let you know that I miss you, um, and see if we couldn't wrangle up a few more art friends, maybe, so we could talk about art together? I don't know, maybe. Um, I just wanted to introduce myself to all of our new art friends. Again, my name is Adrian. I do this art history thing. I was very fortunate to attend the greatest school that the wonderful state of Florida has to offer, the Florida State University, uh, where I got my degree in art history. Um, I love it. I love talking about art. I have really incredible professors there that made me excited about art. And that's kind of what I think I'm supposed to do is make you excited about art because I'm excited about art. And hopefully that comes through, even through these videos. Um, I do lecturing at the Winter Garden Art Association. I started that about four years ago, 2016-ish. Um, and boy, I miss all my Winter Garden friends. Don't we have the best time? Summers, we do Art Lovers Book Club. Oh, it's a hoot. Um, I also am an instructor with the Rowland Center for Lifelong Learning, this continuing education program, an incredible resource for our Central Florida community. So shout out to all my Rollins peeps in Winter Park. Hello, I miss you. Um, what else do I do? Well, I do all of this freelance, so that means I can partner with anybody. I've been invited to speak at churches, other people's book clubs, art associations, but also different art institutions in our area. One of those being Modernism Museum in Mount Dora, uh, where I partner with uh, their restaurant as well, 1921, to do these cool dine and learn programs where people eat and I give a lecture and it is awesome. So shout out to my Mount Dora friends. I miss you guys. Um, in addition to all this art history stuff that I do, I'm also a writer. And I've been so, so fortunate to have amazing opportunities to write about artists and art events happening in Central Florida. To anybody who says that Florida has no arts and culture, I would beg to differ because I am intimately aware of all of the creativity happening in our great state, especially here in Central Florida. Shout out to my art born peeps and to my art scene press friends and family. That's a blog that covers art events happening right now in Central Florida, and they're awesome. You should follow them on social media, okay? I'm also uh, an artist. I do this painting thing. been doing that since 2008, painting and showing my work here in Central Florida. Is that crazy or what? Um, lately, I've been painting in the style of the artists I've been studying, so that's been fun. Um, and check this out, this happened last summer. Huh, featured artist, Orlando Arts Magazine. What a crazy world. Um, but mostly I do this whole art history thing and I've got this blog that's very nerdy and it's very weird, but it's full of art. And since we can't hang out together in person, because we're all practicing social distancing, right? Um, I've des decided to beef up the blog a little bit, if you will. I've been posting three times a week, um, including things like lists of art-related movies you can watch and books you can read, um, other creative uh, resources that you can find online. Most of them are free, so that's cool. And then I put my like art projects up there to see what you think about them. And I just love it. It's just one of the ways I love talking to all of you out there. But I, I know in our crazy times right now that maybe this isn't enough. So I've been working on a very top secret project, another way that we can talk to each other about art. And I've been working on it for a little while now. And I will release another video in the near future announcing this new project. So please stay tuned. Keep, keep me on your radar because I've got more stuff coming your way. And Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. If you want to share it with your friends, you can totally do that. If not, that's fine. I'll never know. But thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.